This video will show you how to properly install a graphic update on the Elite screen via a USB stick. The first method will be how to put the new USB installer file onto the USB stick if you are emailed an update from our graphics team. First, open the email that was sent to you and you will see a link to download the installer file. Click on the link and that will open your default web browser. Click the green download button to start the download. In most web browsers, the downloaded file will appear at the bottom. If you're using Google Chrome, you can click on the tab next to the file and select Show in Folder. This will open your Downloads folder. You can also get to the same folder by finding the Downloads folder on your computer. Next, you will want to open the USB stick folder. You will want to make sure that you back up all the files that you currently have on your USB stick. You will have to format the drive before putting the USB installer file on it. To create a folder on your desktop, right click on your desktop, select New, then Folder, and then name the folder whatever you'd like. Then click and drag all the files from your USB stick onto that new file. Now that all the files are safely backed up, we can proceed with formatting the drive. To format the drive, right click on the USB stick, then select Format, then click Start. Click OK in the warning box. Then click OK once the format is complete. To open the freshly formatted USB stick, right click on the folder icon at the bottom of your screen and select File Explorer. Double click to open the USB stick removable drive. Click and drag the USB installer.zip file from your downloads folder onto the removable USB drive. Now this is very important. The file must be named usbinstaller.zip, or else the Elite screen will not recognize it. To change the name, single click on it and change it to only say usbinstaller.zip. If you do not see the .zip in the name, do not add it, your computer will add it automatically. Now before you remove the USB stick, you will need to eject it. Right click on the USB removable drive and select eject. Once your computer says that it is safe to remove the hardware, wait 5 seconds, then remove the stick from your computer. The second method is if you just finished updating your file within the Elite PI Design software. Within the Elite PI Design software, with your completed layout open, select File, then Make USB Installer. The Save As window will open, select where you would like to save the file. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to save it to the desktop. Note that the file must be called usbinstaller.zip, then click Save. You will see two information messages, Collection Created and USB Installer Made. Click OK for both. Now you're going to want to open the USB removable drive. Again, you will want to make sure that you back up anything that you have on your USB drive as you will need to format it. Now that everything is backed up, it is time to format the drive. Right click on the USB drive and select Format. Then click Start, click OK in the warning box, then click OK once the format is complete. To open the freshly formatted USB stick, click on the folder icon at the bottom of your screen, double click to open the USB removable drive, click and drag the USB installer.zip file from your desktop onto the removable USB drive. Again, the file must be named usbinstaller.zip 
or else the Elite screen will not recognize it. Right-click the USB removable drive and select Eject. Once your computer says that it is safe to remove the hardware, wait 5 seconds, then remove the stick from your computer. With the USB installer.zip file on your USB stick, insert it into the back of the Elite screen. Depending on your installation, a USB slot may have been installed in the service panel. Once you insert the USB stick, wait a few seconds until the blue screen appears, telling you not to remove the flash drive until instructed to do so. If an error comes up, then something went wrong while putting the file onto your USB stick and you will need to try the previous steps again. Once it is finished copying the files, it will say that you can now remove the flash drive. Once you remove the flash drive, the unit will restart itself and your new updated design will appear. This completes the task of transferring an updated design to an Elite PI via a USB stick. If you have further questions regarding the transfer of a layout, please call 419-636-6705 and ask for technical support. <music>